You are the man who gave them the power to destroy themselves. And the world is not prepared. I think that this is probably the most pure piece of cinema I've ever been involved in. I knew that Chris had a very acute vision, and if he were able to render that vision, that this film would be a masterpiece. Oppenheimer's story is one of the biggest stories imaginable. It's one of the most important stories. This is somebody who lived through the most serious questions of our time and, and all time, and dealt with them as best he could. That's why it's so amazing that Chris is making this movie now. I mean, we're seeing parallels. This kind of nuclear reality, you know, people in my generation were born into it. What was really interesting was trying to understand what these guys were thinking and the terrible decisions that were placed in front of them. How about because this is the most important thing that ever happened in the history of the world? It's so propulsive. You almost don't have time to take breath. You feel completely altered. It's a profoundly moving and overwhelming experience watching it. With the sound design and the score and the emotionality of it, it's a very intimate, very personal film on a giant scope. And I don't know how Chris managed to do those two things at once. There is no stronger version of filmmaking occurring anywhere right now. You just know it. We're at the bleeding edge of what you could do with cameras and lights and artists and department heads. When I saw it in its finished form, I was kind of like, wow. Yeah, that's what we were hoping this could be.